find the CIC is a great place to work. Uh, the projects that we work on are extremely diverse. They are anything from a jockey saddle to uh, developing the latest composite materials for not only commercial aircraft, but military aircraft. I started with the Composite Innovation Center in January 2004, just as the center was starting up. We started in a small facility that built a close-knit team that really, I think, is the foundation of the center that has continued to today. The idea for the CAC came from an employee of Boeing, Rick Jensen. In late 2001, early 2002, Economic Development Winnipeg was asked to validate uh, if, in fact, there was an opportunity to develop a composites cluster in Winnipeg. And that cluster actually ended up coming up with the idea of a technology centre, and hence we were formed in 2003. It's been exciting and rewarding to watch the centre grow from those initial four people to the large team that we have today. Having the CIC right in our backyard is phenomenal because they have a, an unbelievable design and test facility for composite manufacturing. And that has been lacking in our industry, and it's a one-stop shop for product and process development right up front. Because of the fact that we were able to identify uh, that there was an opportunity because of capacity in, in composite and advanced materials, what it's done is it's elevated the capabilities within our advanced manufacturing sectors bus manufacturing, ground transportation, uh, aerospace. Several of our composite fabricators have adopted new manufacturing processes, such as RTM Lite, that provide an economic benefit as well as an environmental benefit, whether it be for their staff or the environment at large. I think predominantly the, the accomplishments have been related directly to what our industry's partners have been able to achieve. In particular, uh, looking at our aerospace sector, we now see Boeing. They have a significant work package with the 787 and we were able to support the initial development of the landing gear door, the environmental control system and other parts that they currently produce. We were also engaged with Magellan and supported their on-take of the F-35, which has now culminated in about 140,000 square feet of new manufacturing facility in the province. CIC did a fantastic job of helping us get through the upfront development of our F-35 process capability. Uh, without the CIC's uh, assistance and help, we would have had a, not only a much longer schedule, but a higher cost to get that product to market. Then if we go across and looking at what we've done in the ground transportation area, you now look at a motor coach, J-Coach, and it has lighter weight, uh, low-cost baggage doors. You look at an Excelsior uh, new flyer bus and it has lighter weight, lower cost natural gas vehicle doors and, and uh, floor panels for that bus. When we go out to try and market our community, to try and seek out investment to come in, we leverage off the capabilities that exist with the Composites Innovation Centers. We've been very successful at attracting a number of new customers from bathtubs to transportation to medical, all with collaborations and partnerships with the CIC team. We also provide project management services and uh, we are a solution provider in actually connecting our organization with other organizations, both nationally and internationally, to bring the latest technologies to them. We try and treat the CIC as a division of Eastside. Uh, we're very technically savvy here, but we do need that engineering, design, and drawing support, which the CIC is a great resource for. The fact is, is that because it's a platform for applied research, it has moved into an area where we have some additional capabilities that perhaps we really didn't recognize, and that is around the bioproduct side, looking at biofibers in order to manufacture certain component parts for original equipment manufacturing. So because of that, we have a strong platform through the CIC to be able to continue to grow not only our economy, and not only Western Canada's economy, but really our competitiveness across Canada related to advanced manufacturing, particularly related using composite materials. We started off really just building capabilities within our uh, organization to directly support industry needs. And now we have a skill base of 27 employees that are focused on technology developments within the industry. But our future activities are actually taking this skill base and then moving that forward into taking a leadership position in innovation with our industry partners. Sean has been probably one of the best advocates for the Composite Innovation Centre and for the Composite industry as far as Winnipeg goes. The CIC not only is a hub of excellence and innovation, but it's also put Winnipeg as a Composites fabrication hub on the map. Not only for the aerospace industry, the transportation sector, egg and biocomposites area, they've done a fantastic job and I know we have a great future here in Manitoba and across the West with the CIC assisting us becoming world-class 
entities in the composite manufacturing sector.